AIDS, AIDS. Fuck it, man. I'm saying it. When I was little, I asked my mama what fuck meant. She said, fuck, fuck, fuck. That's what it means. The world looks and sees what it wants. They got memorials written. They got you wasted and dead. Skeleton in your bed. AIDS, AIDS, AIDS. Oliver Wendell Holmes once said, to find true happiness, get a terminal illness and take real good care of yourself. Real good care. Pajama parties, cookies and milk, afternoon naps kind of care. Lots of love, love, love. I see angels flying above everyone's head and miracles all day long in oranges, brown fat crawly bugs on the big time journey across the towpath, ducks in winter, ginkgo trees raining yellow, ginkgo, ginkgo, ginkgo. My dog smiling and wagging its tail to the rhythm of three sweet altos, knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Rivers are always miracles. They aren't stopped by rocks, bridges, boulders, deer bottles, dead bodies, or even dead refrigerators. They go around, over, above, under, embracing all they touch. Never go back to the beginning to get it right. Changing forever, seeking, accepting, expanding, and being. We got more of a world filled with gods, Buddha, Christ, Vishnu, Muhammad, and Henry, the hitchhiker's god. They walk us through to the end, shedding our named coats, our finally pressed out, laid out, figured out, fitted in life suits. No more expectations, no more mundane, earthly matters. Nine to five, skull, famine, weight loss, facelift, fashion statement, free to go home. The early release program, you got mambo till dawn, safe sex, erotic safe sex, free of judgment, guilt, and shame. Death is for the dead and living is for everyone else. AIDS, AIDS, AIDS. Yeah, I said it. Don't memorialize, metaphorize, hypnotize, categorize, or sanitize me. It is hard enough living with your illusion. No more definitions of my death. No more sympathetic death sentence eyes. Because I am not dead, dying, no survey, Bob. I'm living. Just thought I'd let you know. <laughs>